Yate. Hello, my name is Markel Bigay. I am from the Navajo Nation. Senjikin and Ishlan. Hanagahni Beshishin. Zaslana A Dasha Chedo. Tkbaha A Dasha Nele. Shantoho A Dent Nasha. Akut Ego and Senen Ishlan. Hello again, my name is Markel Bigay. I am a PhD student at the University of Arizona in the Ecology Management and Restoration of Rangelands program. And I would like to extend my great appreciation and gratitude to the Intertribal Timber Council for selecting me as a recipient for the Truman D. Picard Scholarship. As a first generation college student, this means a lot to me. And this scholarship will help me to accomplish two important research projects on the Navajo Nation. One of these projects include assessing wind erosion risk on the Navajo Nation and its relation to natural and cultural resources. And the second project entails applying ecological restoration practices to strengthen climate resiliency on Navajo Nation. In the future, I plan to serve as an ambassador, researcher, liaison, and educator for the Navajo Nation and other tribal communities who are interested in promoting and sustaining their natural and cultural resources in coordination with preserving their traditional knowledge for the benefit of future generations. Again, thank you ITC for this wonderful scholarship award. Greetings, I'm a person of the dawn, I'm Micmac, and my name is Tyler Everett. Recording this speech way over here in present day Maine in the traditional territories of the Wabanoaki, the people of the dawn. I'm a second year PhD student at the University of Maine studying forest resource management. I wanna thank the education committee and the board of directors of the Intertribal Timber Council for awarding me with a 2022 Truman D. Picard scholarship. This scholarship will make my academic efforts more attainable, and this is something I am very grateful to ITC for supporting, as I'm very passionate about my research here at the University of Maine. I'm currently working on addressing the invasive forest pest, the emerald ash borer, with adaptive management strategies on tribal lands. This is a critical time to execute this work, as the pest is quickly approaching tribal lands here in the far northeast. The preferred host of the beetle is the brown or black ash tree, which is culturally significant to my people and many other indigenous peoples across the region for its use in the traditional art of basketry. Centering my research on a culturally significant species like brown ash has been very rewarding to me, and I hope to continue my career as a research forester focusing on addressing other tribal priorities in forestry-related research. Well, Ali, thank you again, ITC, for this scholarship. It really means a lot to me, and I appreciate all that you do for forestry and natural resource management across Indian country. Hello, my name is Scotty Fetter, and I'm a member of the St. Regis Mohawk Tribe, and I want to say thank you to Truman Picard for this scholarship that's going to allow me to study at the University of Utah this fall. I'll be majoring in environmental humanities and studying the impacts of environmental industry upon indigenous women. From there, I hope to go on to pursue a PhD and do work with my local community back home in Northern New York. Thank you again for the scholarship, and I'm really looking forward to this next stage in my educational career. Hello everyone, my name is Randall Finley, and I'm from the Confederate Sears Kootenai Tribes in Montana. I currently go to school at Sears Kootenai College in Pablo, Montana. My degree major is forest management. I currently work for CS and KT timber sales program as a forest technician one. I should have my associate's degree after this quarter. And I would just like to say thank you to the Picard Scholarship Committee for picking me. Uh, it really means a lot. Getting a scholarship, it really helps out a lot. And I'd like to say thanks to my work for letting me go to school. And I'd like to say also thanks to Adrian Layton and Rob Kenning for always being there to help me, I guess, when I need help. And any questions I have during school, after school, anytime, um, I'd just like to say thanks. Oh, CO. 
My name is Joshua Friedlein. I'm an enrolled member of the Cherokee Nation, and I'm a Master of Forestry candidate at the Yale School of the Environment. I am delighted and honored to be a recipient of this year's Truman Picard Scholarship. While at Yale, I have been passionate and remain passionate about studying wildfire mitigation through traditional ecological knowledge, land return, and co-management of lands between the federal government and tribal nations. The impact of the Truman Picard Scholarship on my educational career cannot be overstated. Thanks to the memorandum of understanding that exists between the Intertribal Timber Council and Yale, I was able to attend all of last year without paying tuition, and I will be able to attend all of my next academic year without paying tuition. I have immense gratitude for the support and faith that the Timber Council has placed in me. And as I go forth into my career as a public servant, working on issues relating to tribal resource management and forest management, I will keep this support and your faith in me in mind. Thank you. Hello, my name is Christina Hodge. I'm Northern Arapaho from the Wind River Reservation in Wyoming, and I'm in my third year in the forest management program at Salish Kootenai College. Uh, this scholarship helped me in pursuit of my education because it allows me the freedom to focus on my academics and take other learning opportunities. Um, I one day plan to become a forest engineer and design and implement natural resources operations for tribes specifically. Um, uh, thank you to the Intertribal Timber Council for uh, granting me and other students like me this opportunity. Um, it's I see it as an investment in the future of natural resources. Thank you. Hello, Buju Ani. My name is Jennifer LeCount. Uh, my Indian name is Red L. Corman. I am enrolled at Fort Belknap, Montana, Anishinaabe and Grovant. Um, I am currently working towards a degree in forest management at Salish Kootenai College, and I wanted to give a huge McGwitch for the scholarship and for the scholarship opportunity. Um, I'm a single mother, and that scholarship money definitely helps alleviate a lot of the financial burden that comes with working towards a degree of any sort. Um, so miigwech. Hello, I'm Cameron Macias. I am a PhD student at the University of Idaho, and I'm a, I'm a member of the Lower Elwha Kalam tribe in Port Angeles, Washington. And I'm working with my tribe, along with Panthera and the university, to learn more about cougar and bobcat ecology and population dynamics in my tribe's historic use area. And so we're comparing different methods for counting them. We are looking at what foods they're eating, and we're working with five other tribes on the peninsula to monitor cougars and bobcats using GPS collars. And so our goals are to learn more about the role these predators play in the ecosystem, as well as what habitats are important to them. And we're also trying to figure out what methods work best to count them so that we can monitor them into the future and uh, manage their populations sustainably for future generations. And so a huge thank you to the Intertribal Timber Council for this scholarship and for supporting my tribe's wildlife research. This scholarship will help to cover the costs of publishing this research once we finish the project. And once I'm finished with grad school, my goal is to move back home to my tribe and continue working on wildlife research and helping my tribe with their conservation efforts. So again, thank you so, so much for this scholarship. How's it going? My name is Bryce Norling. I'm an enrolled member of the Confederated Salish and Kootenai Tribes and am currently attending SKC in my third year as a forest management student. First way I can think that this scholarship benefits my education is for books and for childcare. Um, I've got two boys and they both go to daycare during the day. So to be able to afford that gives me the opportunity to work on homework, go to class and work part time. This scholarship as well as the trees, you know, they've kept me motivated and they've kept me funded to stay in school 
with minimal debt and you know giving me that peace of mind to just be able to focus on my studies right now i currently work at cskt forestry and timber sales part-time and after graduating i plan to become a forester and continue to work for my tribe even before I started going back to school, I knew that I wanted to preserve and make an impact on our forested areas because I grew up hunting, camping, and fishing in these same mountains. And again, I just want to thank the Intertribal Timber Council for providing Native students like myself with great opportunities, you know, to stay motivated to finish our degree and eventually make a difference in our tribe and our community. Um, so again, thank you guys very much. Hi, my name is Yvette Picard. I am enrolled in the Confederated Tribes of Warm Springs, Oregon. I am Warm Springs, Wasco, Colville, and Cayuse. I am currently enrolled in Salish Kootenai College, majoring in forest management. I also am a timber sale officer for my reservation of 640,000 acres. I am the only income with my granddaughter and the Truman Picard Scholarship will help me so much with my tuition, books, and the expenses that come up. I'll do my best to represent the scholarship and I also want to have a give a big shout out to the Intertribal Timber Symposium Board and committees. It's been a long year and I really appreciate being selected. I'm so humbled and grateful. It's been a long month. Um, I lost my mother not even a month ago and my mother was my biggest support. I now um, carry that strength inside my heart and will do the best that I can to fulfill my goals so that I can help other people. Thank you so much. Hello everyone. My name is Keyshawn Rogers. I'm from the Crow tribe. I'm attending school at Salish Kootenai College located on the Flathead Reservation. My major is Walnut Fire Management. This scholarship will benefit me in many ways through my are helping me with my dorm, my tuition, and groceries and gas. Uh, the career I intend to pursue is uh, firefighting, and hopefully, uh, getting my education so I become so I be can become an FMO for uh, Crow. I intend to bring my knowledge from school and from work back to the Crow Indian Reservation to help my tribe succeed and to bring more resources and thank you for this opportunity. Hello, I am Joni Tobacco, Oglala Lakota from the Pine Ridge Reservation in South Dakota. I am majoring in hydrology and forestry at the Salish Kootenai College. This scholarship will help cover my childcare expenses for the remainder of my undergraduate career. One day, I hope to manage the Black Hills. To the Lakota, this forested island on the prairie is the heart of all that is. It is our most sacred of places. The taking of the Black Hills and the ensuing desecration were major treaty violations. I want to remedy this injustice by managing the forest in a sustainable way, protecting cultural sites and medicinal plants. And I want to thank the Intertribal Timber Council for the scholarship and for the support that it provides. Pema Maya. 